Now on the right of your screen in red trunks, 31 years of Indian champion who has fought three times for the world title. Going to Dallas Bata, being stopped by, he is by far the most experienced test for young Thomas. Impressed with turns here in round number five. Remember, this is the first time he's using the belt in the fifth round. Every other fight ended within four. Annual Stewart, Irving Upjer, Lee Black is his trainer. Referee in this fight, 48 pounds, great and he uses that reach in training all the time. And hey, you've got to hit, you've got to punch back. When you when you make a fight or miss, you've got to punch back. Let him respect you. That way he won't wing. Look at this combination by hands. It's just bent there, and that's why this crowd in Detroit. Yes, he does. You and Golden Gloves champion at 139. He was a finalist to Howard Davis at 100. He just got hurt. He's hurt bad. He's really hurt. Look at Hearns go after him. Ray's in trouble here in the final seconds of the fifth round. Has him right in his own corner, doing a job on Clyde Gray. And certainly, he's got to be impressed and happy to have King Young Wilder. Yes, he sure is, and he's revived boxing in Detroit. Look at these combinations. How's Ray standing up? We know Hearns can punch. Hearns look at going these to work punches, on Ray, and you know would think he'd get arm worry, but look at him throw. He's, he's really impressing me. He's a dangerous fighter. Ray still hanging in there, but it's getting tougher. Seen here in the weekly boxing feed, Hagler coming up, the great middleweight. We've got the Pino Cuevas. And it's just like that, just slide in behind from Detroit. We may have another ground bomber. Intact. You see the old Pedroza of Panama. That'll be direct from Tokyo. We'll have the highlights. I tell you, I think Ray's had the gray out of there by now. He's trying to punch a little too hard. All he has to do is move his hand. Here, this is round eight. That's a long time. I mean, he's still in condition. He's still able to get anything started here against the fierce comes on the right of your screen now. The white nose and swelling under the left eye, and no doubt Hearns, trained, managed by Emmanuel Stewart. He has excited boxing fans in Michigan. Now he's back to his box, the same as the other show. Hey, Gray never stops trying. Down, and you can see he just he knows what he's got to do, but it's long reach. You know the thing is when you throw and Clyde Gray's in condition now. If I, if I was, and it's a game show by Clyde. How far behind he is? Burns would still like to take him out. There it is. Right hand, right. I think it was a punch just before that. It looked like Gray was kind of staggered and off balance, and that long right. He was already on his way to the canvas. We'll take a look at it again on the replay. Clyde Gray, 2-0-3 of the 10th round, a knockout victory, Hearns. There's a, there's a right-hand lead, back with the left hand, but he's bouncing on those legs all the time. There was a terrific right hand. Now he's stepping over to the right, and whammo, one more time. What a knockout.